If you have a parent in a nursing home, you're likely facing a lot of difficult decisions and stressful situations. It's natural to feel overwhelmed, but it's important to remember that you have options and resources available to you. One question that comes up is whether the nursing home can take your loved one's life insurance policy. Let's dive into this issue and provide some advice. First things first, it's important to understand the difference between a life insurance policy and a long-term care insurance policy. A life insurance policy pays out a lump sum of money to your beneficiaries when you pass away. A long-term care insurance policy, on the other hand, helps cover the cost of long-term care, such as the nursing home care. Can the nursing home take your mom's life insurance? Let's address this question. The short answer is no, they cannot. Life insurance policies are typically considered an asset that is exempt from being used to pay for the nursing home care. However, there are a few important caveats to keep in mind. One important factor is the timing of when the life insurance policy was purchased. If your mom purchased the policy recently and transferred a significant amount of assets to pay for it, the nursing home may consider that a fraudulent transfer and could potentially go after the policy. Additionally, if your mom has named a nursing home as a beneficiary on the policy, they may be able to claim those proceeds. Finally, if the estate was named as a beneficiary rather than an individual person, it could open the door to claims. If your mom or parent is going on Medicaid, a life insurance policy could be considered an asset. Any life insurance policy that has cash value over $1,500 is typically considered an asset by the Medicaid. Karen's mother had a life insurance policy worth $100,000. When Karen moved her mother into a nursing home, she was worried the nursing home would take the money to pay for her mother's care. However, Karen learned that the nursing home could not take the life insurance policy as Karen was named as the beneficiary, and therefore it was exempt from the nursing home, but not necessarily Medicaid. Karen was relieved to know that her mother's money was safe and that she could use it to pay for other expenses after she passed.